Good afternoon and welcome to the Paul Ricard circuit here in the south of France. Back now away from Marseille and we have been blessed with glorious weather here for the Ferrari Challenge. Round four about to get underway with the Copa Shell category of racing to go first on this fantastic circuit here uh, with the mountains just behind as you can see. So let's go green, let's go racing. Olga Hansen trying to dive up through the middle of the grid. Absolutely side by side between Singhani and Eric Prinot. Car squirm under braking. Is Gautam Singhani going to lose out on P2? He takes to the curbs and he had to do that to avoid contact. Dayglow yellow car which leads this race with Jack Diver P2. Gautam Singhani is P3. And he's now being pressured by Von Skeltemar who is P4. But you can see what a lead these two have built up over Gautam Singhani who's having to defend now from P3. There is uh, Von Skeltemar then running in uh, P4, chasing home the uh, Gautam Singhani car. Only been very, very close to Gautam. Singhani and we're on board with him now. Looking back at the Fonts, go to my car as he dives up the inside. There's contact between the two of them. To be fair, that was a bit of a bold move. It wasn't really an overtaking place for Fonts, Skeltemar. And now, Diver does get right alongside. They both slow. Skeltemar spawn. Skeltemar spawn. Now be concentrated, the guys in front of you. Lap after lap of trying, does not put that car in the lead. And now there is our race leader, Jacques Diver. There's P2, Eric Prinot. Very nearly two seconds, the gap between them now as Prinot runs off. So Prinot off the circuit, but rejoins. Has that allowed Gautam Singhania to get a bit closer? No, I don't think it has. If anything, it's brought Prinot a bit closer to Jacques Diver. But we're on the final lap. Jacques Diver, who wins Copa Shell, race one here. Uh, Paul Ricard, P3 should go the way of Gautam Singhania. Indeed it does. And Gautam Singhania. He did the best as he can. Uh, podium, fantastic. You can hear the uh, podium being organised as we speak. There's Gautam Singhania, there's Eric Prinot, and here's Jack Diver also with a little bit of a sprint. It's absolutely fabulous, I love it. My man finished third, which is awesome. I'm looking forward to the next one. Jack's been doing the championship, I think, now for over three, four years to realize that Gotham has come for the first championship, first year. So, yeah, Jack is a little, what do you say, uh, nervous uh, most of the time with Gotham being around. We just finished, Gotham uh, qualified again, race two in, uh, out here in Paul Ricard, and he's qualified further than Jack. He's P2, Jack's P4. You know, they'll get focused and get down to racing. Good afternoon and welcome to the Paul Ricard circuit for the second race in the Copa Shell category of Ferrari Challenge Racing here at Round 4 in southern France. Uh, the front row has a very familiar feel to it with Eric Prinot and Gautam Singhania, with Tani Hanna and Jacques Diver on row two, with Von Skeltemar and Eric Chung on the third row of the grid. Turn 15, safety car peels off, we throw the lights up to the top of the screen for you, just look how lively Jacques Diver is from P3 on the grid. It's actually uh, P4 on the grid. Keep an eye on him because it's a... Uh, the outside, as we look at it now, is P1. And uh, Jacques Diver almost alongside uh, Gautam Singhania, but not quite as uh, we get the green for go. It's going to be a real drag race between Prinot and uh, Singhania. Who is going to be first into turn one? It is going to be uh, Eric Prinot. And uh, Tani Hanna is P3. Uh, Gautam Singhania out on his own, a bit in P2 at the moment. The challenge from Tani Hanna has gone away. That's allowed Gautam Singhania to get up the road as Tani Hanna has to focus on uh, defending against uh, Jacques Diver. The two white cars together there, P3 and P4. Okay, push, Just do your line. Do your line. Tani Hanna. And now Gautam Singhania, as I predicted, now both from the same team, 
Certainly no team orders, that's for sure, because uh, every driver for himself out there. So Gautam Singh Hania seems to be really struggling for back end grip. Jack Diver is right on him now, looking for a way past. Down the start, finish straight, they come. We're on board, or we were on board with Gautam Singh Hania looking back at Jack Diver. Diver is in the wrong place, though, unless he can uh, just dive up the inside and turn in before Gautam Singh Hania. Not able to do so, not close enough to be able to do so, but Gautam Singh Hania knows that. The predatory threat of Jack Diver is there, and he's got two and a half minutes to defend this. And that's going to be a big, big ask, I think. Jack Diver is all over the Gautam Singhania car. Singhania accelerates. Jack Diver takes a completely different line, takes a bit of curves. He's just letting the car fall back a little bit. We can't talk. <laughs> it's crazy, crazy. Just went. Very good, very good. You are very good, you are fastest at the moment on the track. Keep like this. Oh, Singhania gets really, really sideways there. Through turn 15 they go. One lap left to run. This big battle for P2 that will rage right to the chequered flag. Can Gautam Singhania make that 458 twice its width to try and prevent Jack Diver coming through? I think it's going to be a big ask. Shinghania crosses the speed trap at 248 kilometers per hour. Now, both of them have worked those tires really, really hard, but it just looks like the car of Diver is better poised than Gautam Shinghania's at the moment. And look at this. Gautam Shinghania and Jack Diver, they stay the same as they cross the line. It's P2 and P3 for the two Kessel drivers together there. <laughs> for the Kessel team for their cars coming home, P2 and P3. Presents uh, P2 to Gautam Singhania, and they all pose for the photographs. And now it's champagne time. <sighs> what a weekend, I mean, double podium again after Monza. Outstanding feeling. Hard race, but yeah, good. Yeah, I moved up, so for better, move from fourth to third in the championship, which is great.